Hello, you all. You already know what we finna get into. We finna get into these messages and see what our Elohim wants us to know at this time. What is our Elohim want us to know at this time? We have the Fool. Seven of Pentacles. Somebody, I seen a magician sticking up too. Somebody, um, yeah. Somebody, this could be an Aries. Because we got the magician, the fool, and the emperor. So somebody was impulsive, thoughtless, and careless, and decided to. Put some work in here with the seven of pentacles they could have put work in some type of group here or it could even be some type of it's either a group or some type of marriage here with this emperor um somebody could be in a hospital or have fallen ill not feeling too well here it may be because of this magician work that was being done here It may be because all of the manipulation, the sex, the money, the lies, the fake love is why somebody is not feeling too well and they could be um, in a hospital or have to or happen to visit a hospital here. We have Aries and Taurus. Yeah, somebody is in some type of pain, maybe suffering here. Three of Swords. Somebody is in some type of pain. Somebody may have had like an upset stomach. Feeling too well, and they had to go get it checked out, and maybe found out it was maybe a little bit more than an upset stomach. Or whatever they were feeling, it was a little bit more than what um, they thought that they could have been going to the hospital or the emergency room for. Whatever it, whatever it is, it upset them. Whatever it is, it upset them. Yeah, they're going to be going through some type of battles here. Some type of struggles. Maybe with their wine, maybe with their penis. Um, it could have them feeling insecure. Maybe wanting them to hold back. Maybe they want to hold back because of whatever this is. Yeah, they they they're burning with thoughts here at whatever this is because it was unexpected. Maybe somebody burning here with the tower.
Yeah, something is being illuminated here. Yep, something was hidden. Maybe something was hiding in their body. And is now showing up. Maybe something was laying dormant and now it's showing up here. This could be somebody's karma here with the Wheel of Fortune, with the Page of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. Maybe for some type of attack or chaos here. Hierophant is is who this person was um, teaming up and working with here. Part of a team is King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo could be a Taurus with the Hierophant and the King of Pentacles here. Something has spread it or something is being spread it here with the Three of Wands romantically. Maybe somebody has some type of threesome too as well here, but it was some type of uh, some team up, some type of teamwork here. So, ooh, we got death here. Somebody might pass away. What's the What's the three of pentacles? What's the three of pentacles? What's the Thank you. We got the Queen of Wands with the Ten of Wands. Ooh, somebody panicking and worrying here. Ooh. This Queen of Wands, this King of Pentacles or this Queen of Wands was spreading something and they stressed the fuck out about it here, whatever this is. They also could have had some type of threesome with an emperor too. Maybe they had a threesome with another man. It could be two men and a woman. Yeah, this was some type of partnership here. Look, nine of swords, eight of swords with the damn devil. Somebody panicking and worrying about um, whatever this is. It could be getting to their head here because they could feel oppressed and trapped by whatever this is that they got. What's the Queen of Wands? What's the Queen of the Seven of Swords. This person been lied about something. This is a, some crazy type of betrayal here. And some type of manipulation. We got the Hermit.
this person tried to cause some type of difficulty here and have somebody at a loss with the five of cups here <laughs> for a new relationship. Judgment is being called on this person, whatever they did. What is the King of Pentacles? What is the King of Pentacles? The High Priestess. of Pentacles with the Knight of Wands. Maybe this person was doing something risky or sexual for some type of abundance. What's the high priestess for this uh, king of pentacles? Maybe they have some hidden secrets here. Something was hidden about who this King of Pentacles was offering to here or communicating with. Something could have ended here. Maybe there was some type of exchange here. Money for sex or something. What's going on with this, uh, what's this Emperor here? What's this Emperor? friend that they could have celebrated with three of cups they probably was at the crib uh celebrating drinking and then they end up getting into some wild shit somebody could have lost a baby or maybe somebody even got pregnant after dip getting into this wild shit here somebody could have got pregnant maybe they had a miscarriage or lost their baby This is some type of threesome here. Two men, one woman. Somebody could have got pregnant and they don't, maybe they didn't know which, who the father was or something. Yeah, because look, right after this five of cups, it, it, it's the six of pentacles. They could have wanted it to be somebody else's, you know, like this two gifts in hand. Like both of these, man, <laughs> need to buy a gift. Oh, man, this is crazy. But she did. This chick wanted it to be one of theirs, though. She ain't really wanted to be one of the other ones too much. Maybe the friend did add it in and joined in. She really wanted it to be somebody, maybe the one that she really liked here. sex though look when I said somebody was paying for sex nine of pentacles somebody was paying for sex though Ooh, somebody fell out a loss here with the five of cups
somebody might even uh, lose some type of abundance here. Yeah, somebody feel at a loss. Yeah, somebody might have um, somebody lost money. Somebody may have lost, you know, an equal give and take in a lover situation, which is justice here. Whatever that is, is balance. Whatever it is, whatever is being communicated. Yeah, they didn't went from having it to being in stable instability here. Some type of losses being communicated. This is wild, though. This, um, yeah, so I lost some abundance and a lover, and possibly a baby, or they could just feel sad and guilty and heartbroken because the baby probably ain't who they wanted it to be. They was doing some risky shit. Something was supposed to be hidden. Maybe somebody is in and getting paid for sex here. Yeah, somebody feel defeated with the strength in the five of swords. Somebody feels defeated here. By whatever work they was putting in here could have been teaming up to do some type of work and it was illuminated what they were doing this feminine could be a Scorpio an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius a Virgo or a Capricorn is masculine is a Taurus Pisces, Capricorn, Sagittarius, Virgo, This, this emperor could be a, a, a Aries, a Leo. But the signs that I'm seeing here between these three people, with this risky shit that they was doing, they was doing, they was being manipulative, doing magician work and sex. That That was all going on. But then whatever this is, and some bullshit, and some bullshit then came out of this. But the signs that are very prominent between all of these people is Virgo, Gemini, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo. But they're de de whatever this is, this is defeat.
are these people sharing diseases? Yeah, these people are sharing diseases. Was this some type of threesome? Yeah, these people are sharing diseases. They had a threesome. I'm just trying to clarify some of the things that I'm seeing because it is really a mess here. It's really a mess. Was there magic involved? Did someone lose a child? Yeah, somebody either lost a child or will be losing a child or some type of pregnancy, whatever this is. Oh, let me add the one last question I gotta ask. Was this two men and one woman? Okay. Yeah. So somebody was doing magician work, doing foolish shit. This is why they gonna be sick, end up in the hospital, probably with a disease here. Shit is spreading, these people spreading shit, having threesomes, pregnancies. People getting paid for sex. It's just a mess. It's just a mess. A mess, a mess, a mess. Ooh, somebody might have like some type of slow death. Somebody might pass away slowly. Um, be careful of anybody trying to offer something to you or date you because they might try to spread it to you. Had your ass in the hospital with the four swords. Mm mm. Don't be taking no equal give and take from nobody. Cause uh, I mean, I wouldn't say nobody, but <laughs> you better you better make sure they go get tested. You better make sure they go get tested. I don't care how they come off to you. If they try to come off like an angel, like everything all sweet. You need to tell them to go get tested because it could be some type of manipulation here. Somebody is having, somebody is going through some type of slow death. And I don't think it's spiritual. Somebody trying to have something with you and then you going to get it and it's going to spread through your body and your ass going to be down for the count and it's four of swords just like whoever this is. Basically, so if I was you, yeah, it's whoever this emperor is that maybe joined in with these people. They didn't got caught up in some shit. Because we got the King of Swords with the Emperor. Yeah, this person going to be trying to hide it. But you better listen to your spiritual guidance about this. Because it's an enemy here.
all they do is celebrate with others. They're going to try to cause you some instability and struggle. If you go, on, if you go there, it's going to spread right to you. Let me make sure this ain't no spiritual, uh, it's looking like slow death sickness, though. Is this person trying to date and give it to somebody else? So they can have it, too? Yeah, that's what I said. This, um, this man gonna try to come off like an angel here, but this man is, whatever this man got is something like a slow death. And they're going to give it to you if you deal with them. It's going to spread right through your body and you're going to be in a four swords in a hospital. I'm telling you. It's going to spread through your body and you're going to be next sitting somewhere in a hospital. Hurt. what I say hurt three of swords this person wants you to be hurt like them suffering some type of loss somebody could be uh somebody might end up uh going to the courthouse to sue somebody to get some type of justice for whatever this is. Because maybe they didn't know. They had the inability to see that this person made a decision to ten of swords they asked. They did this on purpose. They, they ooh, yep. They did this on purpose. So maybe this person is going to the courthouse, right? To get some form of justice receive some type of abundance because of the truth is that somebody was burning here and they knew they was burning and they decided to still sleep with somebody here and now they all sharing the same shit and this person is at a loss here three of swords betrayal heartbreak This person even probably lost passion and, and could be on the verge of losing their home, could be on the verge of even losing their abundance because they feel so took. Two of swords. Two of wands. Somebody, I'm telling you, they made a decision here. Ten of swords to the ultimate betrayal to somebody on purpose. Just so they can hold on to them and hold them back. And here go the devil. Ooh, and here go the moon. I'm telling you. Somebody shysty as fuck. Thoughtless and careless. Mm, mm, mm. It's too much going on. Whole lot of karmics. The devil out here twice. Whole lot of karmic. Whole, had hidden intentions the whole time. And somebody took that leap of faith. And got got. With some shit. It remind me of, um. Yep, now they stressed and burden. It remind me of that R. Kelly series. When they, he made that whole series. Series. And it's like, boop, 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 package. <laughs> it reminds me like a drama like that. It re yep, this person is in regret here. This person regrets. This person is disappointed. This person feels like at a loss. Sad. We got the tower. They just feel like running away.
They feel like running away with what they dealing with. We were all in the house chilling. <laughs> Let me know. Because <laughs> I was about to <laughs> try to make up my own, like, attack. Seven of Wands. I'm telling you. Judgment. Somebody feel under attack here. Somebody wants somebody forgiveness for what they did. They feel at a loss here. Whatever this person did, because they getting karma for it. Whatever this person did, because this this is an attack. Shit, I be taking their ass to court. Call the law. This motherfucker then gave me some shit on purpose. Some this a demon. They don't give a flip. So that begging for forgiveness when you already knew what was up. Ah. I mean, you know, forgive everybody, you know what I'm saying, and, and move on to forgiveness for yourself, but I wouldn't be trying to be all buddy-buddy with this motherfucker, and they done did this shit, this some bullshit. Somebody gonna be like, well, well, I should never fuck with that couple. Why would I? Have a threesome. <laughs> I was so drunk. Now I feel dumb. My shalonga burning and I keep tossing and turning cause I feel on fire the phone's ringing the phone's ringing hello Hello, I got something to tell you. Remember those wild times we were having in that wild night? I'm pregnant. What? What you telling me, fool? Because I was with you and him and you know it and it's out of one of y'all that ain't my baby it's like let me get off this. <laughs> uh, I'm not laughing at this situation I'm laughing at myself trying to come up with some shit <laughs> can't sing word for lick honey can't sing word for lick Anything else? Yeah. Somebody wish they. Ne I wish I wish I never met her, even though. Yep. Somebody fell in the five of swords. The five of swords. They feel betrayed. <laughs> They feel in the five of swords for the celebration. <laughs> they feel betrayed here. Um, because whatever this was, them having this little threesome or whatever, they feel good. Like, yeah, like, you know, like a victory. I just, you know, had a threesome, but it was very deceitful. A lot of betrayal, a lot of underhandedness here. This this um, emperor could be trying to search for spiritual guidance now, maybe because of some truth here. Now this person looking for the most high to start a new beginning. 
because this person biscuits was burning it. Some fire and then uh, see just laugh at the situation. So look, that's how I be, man. I already know. <laughs> That's how it be, like, shit get too hot. You like, listen, shit got too hot. This man, like, father. This man was also spiritually guided to the truth about whatever partnership he was in. But this person could be trying to connect to the divine, like, father, shit. That's how it be, though. It get hot. Like, you be thinking you can handle everything on your own, and... You be just partying, doing what you doing, kicking it like shit. Yeah. Then, then the unexpected happen where you be needing them. That's how it be. Sometimes it be taking these type of situations to even get there. Like, man. we have here. Trust in Yahweh with all your heart and lean out on your own understanding. Yeah, you ain't gonna be able to you ain't gonna be able to lean on your own understanding at this time because especially if either whomever out of this thruple had something, you could kinda, you know, get pissed off, wanna retaliate yourself and you know just feeling messed up about the situation and that'll be you leaning on your own understanding because then you end up hurting somebody right but in turn when you try to hurt somebody else you end up hurting yourself like say for instance you walk in on your partner cheating right and you do something to them not only did they get to hurt you once by the betrayal and things of that nature, but now you also hurt yourself because now you caught up, got to go to jail, or even if you don't go to jail and get caught, you on the run. You know what I'm saying? It's just too much. So it just be like, it do be best to lean out on your own understanding of things. And I know that's easier said than done because sometimes it do be hard to, you know, take that step back, but that shows your strength. It's easy to fly off the handle and retaliate and do something dumb, but it'd be hard that when you're in that heat of the moment to hold your composure and walk away. That ain't easy. And it only takes a split second for you to change your life forever just a decision like that like and it be over and a lot of people who have made them split second decisions they'll tell you like it wasn't even worth it so it'd be good not to lean on your own understanding of things and just even in this situation Somebody didn't even belong, you know, in a situation. And maybe this is what you needed to get on your spiritual journey so that you can start seeing the truth of things. So that you can um, call on a divine so he can take action in your life. So when things like this occur, you know, the divine intervenes within our life in many different ways that sometimes we don't even know what we're getting protected from. It could be something so simple as, say, you was going to kick it with, like, okay, just instance for this night, y'all kicking it, drinking, and then y'all end up having sex, and all of this stuff occur, right? Listen, maybe maybe with even being connected with the divine, maybe that night wouldn't even have went like this. It needed to go like this. We ain't changing nothing. I'm just giving y'all, like, a scenario. At, you know, with being in tune and following spiritual guidance and the divine taking action in your life. Something would have occurred where you wouldn't even have made it over this house to even be able to kick it and have these drinks.
You know what I'm saying? It just, you know, things can turn out differently. How amazing are the deeds of Yahweh? Give thanks in all circumstances for for this is Yahweh's will for you and Yahshua the Messiah. So, you know, still give thanks. Um, regardless of the situation, you're still breathing. You can still connect. You can still get healing. You can still see clearly and make better decisions for yourself in the future. And then what's even could be even being communicated to you is a new beginning. You can walk away towards your truth and happiness, you know? Eight of Cups. It says here, in his hand are the depths of the earth, and the mountain peaks belong to him. Be still and know that I am Yahweh. Bottom of the deck. Yahshua is not, Yahshua is not only a remedy for your weariness and trouble, but he will give you an abundance of the contrary. Joy and delight. I hope you all got a message from this read that will help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all later. Peace.